Stakeholders are calling for the entrenchment of gender justice in the country's national policy to encourage national integration in the country. The call was made in Abuja on Tuesday by a network of women's rights groups, federal government agencies and civil society groups. Plus TV Emmanuel Ihejene filed in this report as presented from our studio. Sensitization workshop was championed by the Ministry of Labor and Employment in collaboration with the Oxfam Nigeria with the agenda for the validation workshop of the National Workplace Gender Policy. In her welcome address, the Director Inspectorate of the Ministry of Labor and Employment, Mrs. Olaolu Olaiton, who was represented by a director in the ministry, Dennis Eje, noted that gender equality in workplaces will enhance productivity and peaceful coexistence. He further stated that accountability in governance, economy, and gender justice were the reasons Oxfam Nigeria supported the program. This demonstrates your commitment and support to ensure that Nigeria has a robust national workplace policy, gender policy, that not only addresses the issue of gender equality and the empowerment for national development of our dear country, Nigeria, but also aligns with global best practices. We are pleased that over the years, our programs have touched the lives of many marginalized uh, Nigerian youth, elderly women, young girls, persons with disabilities, and indigenous communities. Let me revisit the main issue that made us here today to say that I'm deeply honored and excited to welcome each one of you for this vital conversation on advancing inclusive gender workplaces. For other stakeholders, the proposed policy is not just for women or men, but for humanity in general. They say the day of celebrations will come when the Federal Executive Council approves the policy as a national policy. We cannot talk about women without talking about our men, and we cannot talk about men without talking about women. Uh, women. And so for any policy on gender, what we first of all have to resolve, because even when we reach equality, even when we are the same, Nature has actually not totally made us the same. Our nature, our biology is different, and nobody is fighting that. I'm a woman, you know, and you know what I have gone through in life to be a woman. You are a man, you know what a man has gone through? That man has never carried pregnancy, and has never menstruated. So how does he understand what it is for me for the 60 years of my life to go through that? So. You see, we are the same, but not the same. As we rise from this meeting, we must not forget that prosperity will hold us responsible for the continued exploitation and vulnerability of women and girls if we fail to act now. Our prayer is that the labor sector in Nigeria becomes efficient and effective while respecting the rights and dignity of women and girls. It is expected that a document will be released at the end of the workshop to serve as a guide that will bring an end to gender discrimination and injustices in all facets of Nigerian society. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.